Hey, what's on going? What's going on, guys? Good morning, good afternoon. It is good morning, Romania. And today, I got the DLC Aftermath. I mean, I know it got released yesterday, but I didn't get any time to play on it because of school. That I know that is terrible. But anyway, so I'll start. I was thinking about starting a new series on my channel called Childhood Stories. Um. You know, to get people more interested in my channel. Look, I almost died there. I just got in the game. This is my first scavenger game. So, I watched a couple of videos so I don't look like a noob when I first play. Um, but anyway, I love Aftermath so far. I can't stop playing it. Um, anyway, with my childhood stories. Um, I'm thinking about, since I am from Romania. How about if I started off with how I almost died in Romania. Um... I mean, what can I... Alright, so, first, I was, you know, I was seven, I was seven in Romania, before I came to America, and, like, we were playing with my friend, my sister and I, and one of my friends, um, we were playing Ding, Ding Dong Ditch, yes, and it got pretty intense, I mean, so there's this lady that we knew she was crazy up in our apartment where we lived. And she was she was like on the fifth story. We we're on the we we're on the first. So we we ding dong niched her five times in a row. So the first time we go, ding you know knock knock, run all the way down. She she hears us, and then she she, she ignores us like oh okay fine they're they're just not gonna do anything. Second, we go up there again, ding dong ditch, run. For our lives now she's chasing us it's all you know it's all a good laugh there and everything and then we start with what is it called then we start with um, so that was the second time then we decide to go the third time ding dong ditch I, I just love saying that um, if you know what it's called in Romania I mean Romanian I might as well tell you well no you can have to find that on yourself um, but anyway, I mean, third time, I mean, fourth, I'm on fourth, we go up there, we, we know, ding dong ditch, we knock, she opens the door with the broom, I mean, literally, oh my god, I was scared to death, I mean, that broom was like, you know, it's a hardwood broom, and oh my god, she whacked me right in the arm, oh my goodness. It hurt so bad. I was running for my life. Look at this. What a double. What a double. Anyway. I mean, literally. Oh my goodness. It hurt so bad. But I was still running. I mean, it was all fun. Fun and games until someone gets hurt. Um, now, third. Uh, man, I just I have to go back to kindergarten. I can't count. Um, fifth. We went up there. She. I mean, we ding dong ditch. And then we ran for our lives again. Like it was, it was still funny. Cause you know, seven year old like, oh yeah, this is funny, ha ha ha. And then she goes talk to our grandma, and tells us that we're ding dong ditching her, her um, apartment, and it's not cool. And we were laughing so hard. And then, wow, I actually count wrong. We actually ding dong ditched six times. You can imagine where she was going. To. I mean. Now she was pissed. So, you know, we go up there again to apologize that we're sorry, but we take dong ditch, we say we're sorry, and we run away. Oh my goodness. Um, then, look at that, I missed the guy. But, I mean, I'm just too quick with my, just pull it out of nowhere and just kill that guy. Um, so, we go downstairs, like if you know in European countries um the apartments usually have like an outway that you enter and there's doors there i mean so we're sitting there there, there was no roof on ours um so we're sitting there and the lady you know how little kids talk and sit in one place they never move so the lady takes like you know a jar let's say it had about it could hold at least half a gallon it was that big. She chucks it down from the fifth story. So in Europe, it's technically sixth story. She chucks it down all the way. 
Oh my goodness. It barely missed me by like one inch. It was just that close. That could have killed me. And she, she, she just didn't even say sorry. Like, are you serious? Like, she is such a hypocrite. Oh, I don't know if that's the right word. But anyway, I almost died there. Like, literally died. Like, I cannot understand that somebody would actually think of throwing a jar at a freaking seven-year-old. That's so cheap. Look at that death. That is so cheap. But anyway, chucking a, go a jar at, seven at a seven-year-old. Do you do that? I bet you don't. I I bet that if like a normal person would not chuck a jar at a at a kid. But then again, she was crazy and never made fun of her. Um. Anyway, like I still have a lot of time to talk about, and I know I haven't uploaded a new video, but I was waiting for aftermath. I mean, I have another gameplay from Operation Metro with me uh, aggressive sniping, but I'm not gonna upload it right now. Um, I was trying to get a scavenger gameplay, and, I mean, this is like, two, half an hour gameplay, I just got it, in my time, um, I mean, that, I mean, now I have unlocked the crossbow, so, I'm promising you guys, a only crossbow, uh, what is it, crossbow only montage, like, that will be epic, a crossbow montage. I don't think anyone has made it yet because it's it's pretty tedious, a lot of work. Um, best gun, in my opinion, for what it, for scavenger. Uh, one is either the Glock, not the Glock, the G17, the one that's automatic with the red dot sight, or suppressor if you want to run around and only with the knife. I that map. Um, I mean the best. What is it? best map for the G17 is Azdadi Palace because no one look at this almost a double the guy has 2% health are you kidding me from a double I'm just done anyway <laughs> I mean I am just you can expect way more scavenger gameplays I mean I I was thinking about like I was having such a hard time deciding um, you know deciding about what to do in um like what I, I am s like oh my god I'm, I am stuttering right here I mean I was trying to decide between back to Karkand or Karkand no Karkand and um or close quarters or aftermath because I was like you know I want guns but then I was thinking what about a crossbow montage now that would be epic and plus it's fairly new but there's literally no one playing Aftermath on PC. There's literally a thousand people playing Aftermath. That is so sad. Literally so sad. I can't. I just can't. Like. This server is like. I'm so lucky I found this server. There's literally one server. I don't even have a rush server. Can you believe. Sorry about that. I had a hiccup. Um. They, I have no rush server for Battlefield 3. What is going on with EA? I mean, no full one. I mean, there are, but there is no full one. Like, there literally no one bought this DLC. Like, what the crap? Um, but anyway, um, I really lost where I was. But with the childhood stories, what you can learn from that, back to that topic, is don't ding dong ditch on the craziest lady in an apartment or anywhere. And I've heard that in America. Look at this. That should have been my double, man. That should have been my double. But in America, what I've heard is instead of ding dong ditching, is you go to people's doors and you take a crap on their front door for fun. I mean, that is just li literally outrageous. Like, why in a like normal person? would never do that but here again in America this is what happens I mean just like I don't even know I, I would lose respect for people who do that except I don't like the tube magazine I wish you could resupply it I mean I don't like that like the guns you just I mean it, it is realistic I mean they try and get it all realistic but anyway I wish like if a guy died you should be able to pick up his I'll look at this. I get the crossbow. 
and I'm trying to find someone. Look, did you see that? That should have been literally a headshot. Nothing happens. So I'm, I'm like, here, let's try again. Let's, let's, let's like the first time you're using a crossbow, so I'm thinking, what can I do? And then I see, ooh, let me pick this up. Boom. What a headshot. What a headshot. Accuracy ripping. I deserve that. And then just the rest just are off. And then I get a hit marker. That should have been headshot. Didn't happen. Like, I hate when I get hit markers. Like, look at that. That is literally neck or head. And I didn't get anything. And then another thing I hate is suppression. Like, you literally can't see anything if you get sniped. Like, suppression, I hate it so much. Like, everything just it gets blurry, and I just hate it. And the only complaint I have with Aftermath is... What can I say? Is that the maps get so laggy on 64 players. Um, because there's just so... The maps are so well designed, except... This map is not yellow, but the other three maps are so yellow. Like, it doesn't even look like Battlefield. It looks like pl Battlefield Play for Free. If you don't know, to search down on Google. Battlefield Play for Free. It's free to play, Battlefield. It has mainly the back to car kind of maps, all of them. And then three more maps that are not in it. Um, and obviously the graphics are not the same, but still. I mean, it would be pretty cool if they could bring uh, Play for Free up to these graphics. But then... Dice would lose so much money, so much money, it's not even funny. Plus, it would take literally like 16 gigs to download the game. Look at this, with the double. Um, I mean, this was a 1.5 KD, I think. It should have been 2, but... I mean, I it, it's my first... You gotta give me a break, it's my first um, scavenger gameplay, so I, I have no clue, like... In the gameplay, I have no clue what to do. Um, except, there's like, it takes literally three bullets to kill a guy. It is so annoying. Look at this. I get the guy. I'm all good. And then, the MP5K is so dumb. Look at this guy. It's like he saw, like he knew I was right there. He shot in the direction that I was. Headshot, boom, dead. Ah, oh, Jesus. Um... The gameplay is coming to an end. Um, hope you guys enjoyed my first, you know, what is it called? My first scavenger gameplay, obviously. Um, childhood stories, how I almost died. Um, I mean, it's just I'm starting a new series, and after this series is done, I'm gonna. St I mean, it's gonna be for a long time. Childhood stories, um, and I'm I'm in high school right now, so couple years you can expect you know high school stories maybe from me um, if you get if you did if you enjoyed it please subscribe have a wonderful day and I'll get to work and try making that um, expo if that's how it is I mean that crossbow gameplay thank you guys for watching have a wonderful day goodbye